Hey everybody, Mark here. I just want to go over the file for the billboard design real quick. It's pretty straightforward, but I just want to call your attention to a few things. Number one, as always, the first thing you're going to do is you're going to cut this sample slot right up here. It's 0.12 inches wide. That represents the MDF that I used in this particular design. That's very standard for MDF, but you want to make sure that your material is going to fit in this uh, slot. And the way you do that is to cut this first and then poke the corner of your material through that hole. See if you like the fit. If you do, then go ahead and cut the rest. If you don't, then you're going to want to adjust the different slots and tabs that are in this design to accommodate for your chosen material. Now, if you're using something that is labeled 1 8 inch, a couple things that, that you'll need to know. This, this slot right here is where the sign goes, and you're going to see that in the project overview video as well. If you have something that's 1 8 or less, you know, right around the 0.125 inches, you're going to be just fine right here, so you won't have to change that. However, depending on what the measurement is specifically of your material, you may or may not need to adjust this slot right here or this set of slots in the base, and then this slot right here for the man on the ladder. So make sure that you cut that sample, that sample slot first, right there, and then if you need to, go through and adjust these. So that's the first thing. Number two, if you are using, if you're going to be using the man on the ladder as part of your design, you're going to cut this red one here. If you're not going to use the man on the ladder, you're going to cut the green one because this slot right here is for the ladder. If you're not going to do that, then cut the green one. Don't cut both of these, just cut the one that you need. All right. So let's go up here to the top. We'll just look at the text together. Number one, delete all this text before uploading. After you've done all your editing here and you don't need this text anymore, delete this text because if you don't, Glowforge lately did another update, of course, that makes things weird. And one of the things it does is if this text is left in there, then it has a tendency to group everything together in ways you don't want. So delete this text first. All colors equal cut. And again, if you're using the ladder and the man, cut the red base. If you're not using the ladder and the man, cut the green base. Other than that, this is really straightforward. I think you're going to really like it a lot. Let me know if you have any questions and make sure if you haven't already, watch the project overview video so you can see how things go together.